Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel PG Analytics. In this video, I will cover one scenarios that is asked in interview recently. So let's understand the data first and then we will see the questions. So this is the data where we have data related to employee, employee ID, employee name, their manager ID, department, city and salary. So basically we have data to employ their manager, their city and salaries and their department. So this is very common data because based on this data, a lot of questions asked in interview. So today I'll talk about what question is asked in Tableau, but you can see there are a lot of questions that is asked in SQL also on top of the same data. Now the question that is asked is, we have to show the list of manager name, their employee name, who is drawing the highest three salaries under each manager? So that is a question. So we have manager, their list of employee and their salaries. So we have to show those employees that is getting the highest three salaries under each manager. So let's see how we can implement that. So I'll just copy this data and paste it in Tableau. So I'll get all the columns. So I can get all the columns. Now I'll just drag, I'll just remove it or I'll create the new sheet. So first I'll drag the manager ID. So we can see we have six managers. Against that we will drag the employee name. So first manager ID, we have three employee under that second one having six employee and so on. And now I'll drag the salary. So right now this salary is, it is the salary of each employee. Now what we want, we want to show the list of am manager, their employee who is drawing the highest salaries. Now what I'll do is I'll just sort the data of employee based on their salaries. So I'll just sort it in descending order based on their salary. So we can see manager ID one having three employee and the data is coming in sorting order. So in second manager, it is also coming in sorting in descending order. So highest one is coming on top. Now I'll add one calculations using index function that will assign the index to each row within the partition. Convert to discrete, we can see the index functions will assign the index to each row in ascending order. Now what I want when the manager ID will change, the index again should start from one. So by default, you can see it is coming in ascending order. So let's restart the index for each manager, edit table calculations, specific dimensions, restart every manager ID. So now we can see when the manager ID will change, again the index will start from one. Now if I want to see the top one employee of against again under each manager, then I will just apply the filter and select one. So we can see for each manager, we are getting the highest one but we have to show the top three. So I'll select one, two, three. So we can see against each manager ID, we are getting the top three employee who is getting the highest salaries. Let's verify that. So this is our data. I'll just sort the data based on their manager ID. So let's pick the four or 10. First I'll select the four, manager ID is four. Against four, we can see there are four employee and the top three you can see first is Steve, then Madhavan and then Winnie. So let's see, are we getting the same data in Tableau? So against four is Steve, Madhavan and Winnie. So that means we are getting the correct data. Let's verify that for 10, I think for 10 manager ID, we have only two employee. So these will come under two, top three. Let's see for 11, how many employee we have. So again, for manager ID 11, we have four employee. 
and in top three we will get the last three so krishna will not come so let's see the 11 krishna is not coming ankit kumar and vikas so it is in the sorting so this is the first scenario now the second question that is asked on the same data set is find out the manager who is having the highest reportees for each department so in our data we have the department 10 20 these are the department i want again for each department which manager having the highest number of reportees let's implement that also so for this i'll track the department so department is coming under measures first i'll convert to dimensions so we have four department 10 20 30 40 against each department we can see we have multiple manager id i want to show the top one against each department having the highest number of reportees so to get the number of employee i'll track the employee name by default it will show as a dimension convert to count listing so department 10 having two manager and these are the number of employee. Now under 10, I just want to show the top one manager having the highest number of employees. So in this data, that is four. For department 20, it is three. Now again, I will sort it. Sort by field descending order based on the count distinct of employee name so we can see it is coming on top four then two then second department six one it is coming in sorting order again i will use the same logic track the index convert to discrete it will assign the index to each row in ascending order and show the index as a filter and select only sorry we have to first restart the index for each department so added table calculations departments restart every department so we can see one two one two because for each department we have max two manager and then we will show the filter select one so under department 10 manager id is for having the highest number of reports i hope you enjoyed the videos Thank you so much for watching it and please like and subscribe.